Hey everyone, hope you're having an amazing day. It's Mark Weens. I'm in the beautiful islands of Trinidad and Tobago. It is a Sunday and today we are taking a day trip to Paramin, which is a village in the mountains just north of Port of Spain. We're gonna meet up with the crew from Foodie Nation and they make amazing food videos throughout Trinidad and Tobago. And we're gonna also be meeting up with Uncle Clyde, who, who is Thank a you. legend Thank of cooking you. traditional Trinidad and Tobago food. Yeah. Thanks to Uncle yeah. Clyde. And thanks for Mr. Mark also. And he's gonna cook for us an entire Sunday lunch. Oh wow, <laughs> oh, that's stew pork. Yeah. The gravy. It's going to be an incredible day in Trinidad and Tobago, and I'm going to share all of the delicious food coming up with you right now in this video. Better belly bus than good food waste. Better belly bus than good food waste. Good morning, man. Man, you're up. What's up? Great, great. Good morning. Good morning. Can again. you remind me your name again? Kezi. Kezi. Kezi yeah. JD. JD yeah. from Foodie Nation. That's right. And actually, this trip is not that far, but we're gonna go into the mountain and the road is steep. But we are jumping into the, the land cruisers and we're gonna take these up the side of the mountain to Paramin. Love this truck. We're on our way. And guys from Trinidad, you all know the saddle starts at saddle in. Um, How long is the drive to get to Hanuman? Um, our first stop might be like 20, 20, 25 minutes. Okay. If that much. That's our first stop. All That's right. our first stop, yeah. All right. So, Mark. Yo. If you hear any screaming in the back there, that might be me. <laughs> <laughs> so, we don't want you to put that out there. <laughs> Throughout Paramin, wherever you see these roads, the concrete roads, it's agriculture that did it. And obviously, you have the grading on the roads for traction. Oh, that area is Paramin over the there. The entire thing going straight to the top. Okay, so that's where we're gonna head eventually. We've arrived to our first destination and the views are just spectacular as you get into the mountains. And again, this is known as the spice basket or the herb basket of Trinidad and Tobago because the mountains are so fertile, the beautiful soil, it's so green, it's so lush. Oh, it's a, an incredible place and the views are absolutely spectacular. Hi. Hi. Nice to meet you. And this is our special Hello, guest, good morning. Yeah. Hi. Mark, Hi. nice to meet you. Right, so all you already. So our first stop today is with Miss Julia. And what are you gonna prepare? Coconut bake. Coconut bake, oh, okay. Is it like a coconut bread? Yeah. Okay. <laughs> All right, cool. This goes together with the, yeah, the coconut yeah. you were blending. Mm -hmm. I see. Yeah. Just keep salt. All right. Just, just, just a little bit. Depends how much you're making. It depends on how much butter you're going to put because they want it to stay soft. Okay. And really nice. I'll just mash it up. Okay. Does that make soft? So that coconut is going in? Yeah. Oh. Oh. You have to knead it soft. You can't knead it hard. <laughs> no pain, no pain, thanks God. <laughs> Even if she did it, any balls now? I did something right on this slide. <laughs> Coconut bake needs to rest for a while before it's baked. And in the meantime, she's going to make some of the cocoa tea. Okay. This is the cocoa bar. So it includes nutmeg, cocoa, and that's going to be grated. Grating that to make the cocoa tea, which is not actually related to tea at all, but it's more like a chocolate milk beverage, Trinidad style. <laughs> Yeah. Um, so cinnamon bark? Yeah. 
Ooh. Nutmeg, that's gonna take it to the next level. <laughs> One of the most aromatic spices on earth. Oh. Yeah, just a little bit. Thank you very much. Thank you very much. <laughs> Cheers. <laughs> oh, it's so good. Yes, thank you, Auntie Julia. This is amazing. I think what takes it to the next level is all that spice. The bay leaves, the cinnamon, and the nutmeg in there. The... Mm -hmm. It's so aromatic, yeah. You can actually smell all those herbs. Right now we're going to do the saltfish. Salt. Saltfish, okay, saltfish. Bulljol. Okay, saltfish. Tomatoes. Whoa, a lot of tomatoes go in. <laughs> Well, that's ready to go. <laughs> and how long will that bake for? Approximately 20 minutes. 20 minutes, okay. The coconut bake goes into the oven. The salt fish is boiling down, starting to become really aromatic, and the, all the juices are coming out of the tomatoes and onions. Very soon, it will be time. Yeah, it's really cooked down. Yeah, it's really cooked. Amazing, thank you, Auntie yeah. Julia. Okay. The bake is ready, the salt fish is ready. We're heading outside to start eating. Oh, yeah. Show us how it's done, Zach. No pressure, no pressure. Fresh <laughs> oh, out of the oven. Awesome to be eating out of Kalabash, one of the greatest bowls, and we're scooping in, getting that fresh, fresh bake and that salt fish. Oh man, it smells so good. You smell that coconut. Fresh pepper sauce that Auntie Julia made. Oh yes. <laughs> So typically, this is a combination you would eat together, mm -hmm. all, to yeah. all together, yes. and then they, oh, for breakfast yes. especially. Sure. Okay, okay. Breakfast. for breakfast. Spots, yeah. And another re-up on that cocoa tea as well. Because it's a must. Oh, tastes so good in the mountains with that fresh breeze. Yes. They've all gone for the sandwich method. Okay, so that's the way to do it. Usually. The bake. You have to get your hands in there, man. Oh yeah, oh yes. <laughs> Wipe it up. Push it down. Oh, that's beautiful. And you, you can, the, the coconut bake is quite dense. You can feel how hearty it is and how crumbly it is at the same time. Mmm. Yeah, we can't smoke mm. it. <laughs> oh, it's good. Oh, oh, I love the, the acidity of the tomatoes, the tartness of the tomatoes with that salt fish. You taste the coconut, the crumbliness of that bake. Excellent. 
This bake really good though. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Yeah, it is. No, you talk. And really fresh. Mm -hmm. <laughs> mm -hmm. so, I could eat like nice four or yeah. five more. <laughs> Just the bake alone. The bake alone is perfect. Mm -hmm. You're lucky mm -hmm. to come and get probably the best tasting coconut bake. Is this something that you'll find all over Trinidad or yeah, is it yeah. like in this area? Yeah, or? this is, and okay. then your, your parents make it. This home made it like mm -hmm. baking bread home now. Okay. Mm -hmm. Oh, my Auntie Julia is on Not an, everybody on an, might do it as good yes. as yes. everybody. Yeah. Does yeah. Different. Everybody yeah. does it different. Okay. <laughs> Uncle Clyde. He's also, already finished. Uncle also, Clyde is already finished. Thanks to Auntie Julia. But I want you to know how I feel about your beak. Thank you. Excellent. Oh, that is lovely. Auntie Julia. Well, this is incredible. Time, mm -hmm. With a bit of that pepper sauce, oh, that just makes it as well, that acidity. Yeah. Mm. It's so warming and hearty <laughs> in the morning. This is all fish, and then we mm -hmm. have like smoked herrings. You could eat the cheese. same coconut bake with yeah. many different. Yeah. yeah. If you fancy like me, I do egg, cheese, ham, bacon. Oh, okay. Favorite yeah, it almost has just butter or just butter and cheese. Okay. The end. Because it almost has like a biscuity kind of Correct. texture Correct. to it. Mm. So fresh. Mm. Auntie Julia, thank you. Yeah, you're thank you so much. Yeah. Yes, this yeah, was amazing. Welcome. It's so good. <laughs> we are moving on, continuing our way up the mountain. Maybe you go to the back of room. Yeah, boy, boy is right, eh? Me and Frank's JD, JD, close your eyes. <laughs> From here, we're in good hands with Uncle Clyde, yeah. who's gonna take we're us to the mountain and to the cave, right? That's right, yeah. And we're going to take a little visit and see how the cave make up, all that, and you also see the side garden. I'll show you how we root it out and so on. Okay. How they plant it, whatever. And so lots so of lots of herbs and vegetables are grown in these areas in the mountain? Well, yeah. Everything grown here is to the market. To okay. make a little okay. event, you know. Uh, okay. So the, the soil is very it, fertile. Yeah. That's the tradition of farming. You see the anise seed. Oh, this is the anise seed. Well, you could take a smell. It smells a bit like dill. Oh, and then you smell that anise coming through. Oh, amazing. You can taste it too, yeah? It's okay to yeah, taste you it. Try. You could try, right? Yeah, not long enough. Yeah, minty. Oh, <laughs> oh, I love it. Yeah. Oh, it's so sweet. It it's so incredibly sweet. This is what the whole of Parmen do for their living. Oh, okay. They take side and tie it, go to the market, so on. They make their living, and they coming back. They make the groceries and all kind of thing. Ah, okay. So it's like today they have, they have money, and the next day they will have money. Mm. So it's only to go to the market and sell tomatoes, celery. Broadleaf, sive, you have avocados, you have every different thing. And farming people is garden. Mm. Everybody is garden. Again, this area is known as the spice basket of Trinidad. And it's just now we know why. The, the mountains are just filled with beautiful, such healthy herbs and vegetables. And Uncle Clyde is taking us to see more and we're on our way to the the cave. We're here now in the cave and we'll take a little look inside and see how everything is. As you see, the, the farmers will use, you know, just to store certain things, but that's, that's small thing. Oh, they so once they, once they once they harvest the, the vegetables and herbs, yes, they bring and, it into the cave yes. to like process it and yeah, that, clean no, it up? Yeah, they, they clean it out and then go to the market. Okay. And if okay. the rain comes in, they will shelter here. Oh, okay. So it's like a camp. Oh, okay, okay. Yeah, which is nice. It's like the, the farm camp. That's right. Yes. Okay. See? All these go to the market. Oh, <laughs> the broadleaf thyme. I'm gonna eat it. Oh, it's amazing. I love it. So juicy, a little bit bitter, so refreshing. <laughs> oh, what is this, Uncle Clyde? Yeah, ginger. Ginger, okay. Yeah, let's have it here. Oh, yeah, nice. Smell good. Okay, so those are some of the, the main ingredients that especially go into the green seasoning, which is one of the ultimate kind of seasoning sauces of so many different Trinidadian dishes. And so it's green onions, it can be thyme, it can be 
Shadow Benny. Shadow Benny, oh yeah, Shadow Benny. The culantro, okay. It's essential for Trinidadian cuisine. It is. If the meat is not seasoned, it is not good. <laughs> yes. And it's also, I think, something that makes the food here so unique and so special and so flavorful. What is this, Uncle Clyde? This one is the shadow beni. Oh, yes. We mix all this with the seasoning. And this is probably yeah. one of the, the most important herbs that's in all of Trinidad yeah, and Tobago? That's right, that's right. Yeah. Shadow beni, the yeah. culantro. Here are the tree here. This one's kind of growing wild right in the rock. We have plum down there, we have all the lemon trees plant up. Now this lemon plantation going all to the way to the back. Could be anything like 300 trees or more. Oh, wow. The view from up here, you can see Port of Spain, all the different fruits. Yeah, incredible view. Ah, you can just smell the fruit in the air, the oranges, the sugar cane. Yeah. The navel oranges, all the different fruits. Spanish time. Yeah. Are you used? Pom cite. Pom cite. Yeah, pom cite. Mm. Oh, there's nothing better than fruit. Yes. Nat natural fruit. Natural fruit. Yeah, all the time. Ripened and tree fallen. Almost has the flavor of a star fruit and a mango all together in one. What a fruit paradise here on the mountain. Mm. Yeah, it is. Wow, that is so fragrant. Fresh bay leaves. Oh man, the fresh leaves have so much more of an intense aroma. Oh, this is a great little walk before lunch. Just seeing the bounty and the lush Oh, big navel orange. Yeah. Just the paradise, the fruit paradise. When you dry up, you make sure it. Right off the tree, seconds ago. You could do that? Mm. Not so smooth, Juicy. I will stop and start again. Now, next up are grapefruit. This one bag of two of these grapefruits. Mmm. Oh, the grapefruit is wonderful. Oh, nice. This is the cassava. In Trinidad, would you call this a provision? Yeah, provision. Provision from yeah. the cassava. Well, this is the cassava. Okay. Yeah, that's what we're going to eat now. Okay. Yeah. This and tom tom and yes. stew pork. Yes. Yeah. I can't wait. So we picked some herbs and some seasonings, the green seasonings. We're heading back to Uncle Clyde's house where he's gonna cook lunch. <laughs> three days of liming. This from is the Friday ultimate liming to Sunday. Non stop. Non stop. Three days non -stop. You take a sleep, you wake up, you, you bed, you go again. A non stop lime. Non stop, non stop. <laughs> lime as in chill, hang out, eat. <laughs> and just enjoy life. Welcome here in Parmen. That's where we normally do lime on a, a Sunday evening. Every Sunday we lime here. We have our group, it's about 10 of us. We come here, we drink our coffee, drink our whiskey, we bake and whatever. <laughs> Bulljol or fried shark, whatever. So, that, that's the love in the house. I boil coffee first. Okay, yes. well, we're gonna have coffee first. Excellent. Yeah, first. Excellent. So this will boil up and I'll, I'll be there with it, otherwise it will fall over. Oh yeah, it will bubble yeah. up, right? It will bubble That's up right, and... Yeah. Do they grow some coffee in this area? Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Why do you boil it out? It's stirring it all the time. Okay. Yeah. Otherwise it will fall over. And then what's on the menu today, Uncle that, Well, we have macaroni pie, fire on top, fire below. And then I have stew pork. Stew pork? Yeah, and then tom tom. And tom tom. Tom tom. Okay. That's pong right. planting. Thank you, Armin Cup. Uncle Clyde Cup. Yes. 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 All the time. Love, 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 love. <laughs> oh, yeah. <laughs> oh, yeah. I love it. Excellent. The punch and coffee. The papa is a bell coffee. The papa. Sassy or bell coffee. I will put water 
outside to boil the macaroni for the macaroni pie. Oh, you're going to make the macaroni yeah. pie, okay. Fire on top, fire below. <laughs> okay. Yeah. Clyde's. Another one of the dishes that Uncle Clyde is making is the macaroni pie, which he's actually going to make over on the chula full Sunday lunch that Uncle Clyde is cooking, preparing, yeah. along with the stew pork. Okay. Okay, that is to boil up now, and when it boils up, I'll mix up everything with all the different ingredients. Okay. Garlic. Garlic. Spanish thyme. Spanish thyme. Yeah. Well, the bay leaf is for while I'm cooking, I'll put the bay leaf in the food. Okay. When I put it in the pot, and add the bay leaf. This is salt. Not too much. So you're not blending the seasoning? No, 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 just like that. Yeah. Chopped, wow. okay. That's right. Fresh Spanish lime from the tree. Oh, it's so aromatic pot. from the yeah. tree to the pot. Yeah. So good. Cut it off small. I love how he's just chopping it up so it just all those aromatics come out of the pot. It smells so good all coming together. The pendimentos, the, that Spanish thyme is so unbelievably aromatic as well. And the garlic goes in as well. So you see, this is all my piano. <laughs> and then you turn it like this. Assembling the macaroni pie with that hot, freshly boiled macaroni, and then the cheese goes in. <laughs> oh, yeah. So, what I did there is very important. That's the milk. <laughs> the person who passes the milk. Is a yes, it's very a important. Very job. important. <laughs> yes. Without me passing like, this milk, my friend, <laughs> I have the most important job. Oh, yeah. and I appreciate event. your help very much. Oh, but it's uh, like a thanks, sir. You're welcome. Loving the house. Loving the house. Yeah. 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 Okay, ready for fire now. Fire on top, fire below. Oh, the fire on top. Yeah. It's the fire on the bottom, fire on the top. And so it's going to just keep all of that steam and all of that heat coming from all sides. Oh, so for yeah. Uncle Clyde, for stew, yeah, stew, you stew need pork. to start off by caramelizing sugar? Yeah, yeah. Okay. Yeah. We call it browning the sugar. Yeah, browning, browning the sugar. So that's like one of the main, that's yeah. like one of the main characteristics of a stew. Correct. That Trinidadian is stew. how you call it a stew. The sugar ah, has to be okay. brown to start. Gotta brown the sugar. <laughs> okay, and what do we Some have here? Some people put Uncle a Clyde? lot of sugar. Mm -hmm. But I won't do it because I have this. Yes. Ah. Yeah. This is my color. Wait, let me okay. see. Oh, we have Uncle Clyde Ruku. What is Ruku, Uncle Clyde? I doing this from since small. My parents showed me this. Ah, using okay. It. Because they didn't use the sugar. Right. As they put the meat, mm -hmm. they drop in the Ruku in it. Mm -hmm. And that's about it. Is it the same as Anato? Yeah. Or different? It's different to this. It, it is different but similar. Yeah. Okay. You must do it. Mm -hmm. See, you know, I'm not sure. Yeah. I'm not sure. I'm not sure. I'm not sure. I'm not sure. Oh, that aroma coming out of the pot is incredible. And then I love how Uncle Clyde is just, you can t see his experience and just he's so methodical in the way that you're you're doing everything and not, not rushing the process. Okay. Mm -hmm. hey. When we come back, I'll do this turn. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Pong planting. Or we call it tom-tom. Okay. Yeah. 
Oh, you're going to boil them skin on. Yeah. No, we boil them with the skin. <laughs> the original top. Yeah. Born on the room, you know that they got toy balls and bars. Fresh coconut milk. The onion and tomato. Okay, it's gonna go into the stew. Yeah. Ginger. The plantains are ready? That's right. Are these plantains at the stage where they're ripe or not not so ripe? Not too ripe. Not too ripe. No. So here we go. Tom Tom. <laughs> We're almost ready to start eating this amazing mountain parmen Sunday lunch. That smells incredible. What's up? <laughs> Mm -hmm. Nice. <laughs> fire on top, fire below. Fire on top, fire below. Oh, beautiful. We've got carrots and the cheese on top. Yeah, cheese on carrot. Embedded with the fire. Yeah. Great. Love and yours. Thank you, Mr. Mark. <laughs> That's stew. Oh, here we go. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Fresh One last item that they didn't use. Avocado. Thank you. Right into the calabash. We're sitting out here to eat. Oh, nice. Mm -hmm. Thank you, Uncle Clyde. No problem. In what a no meal. Oh, and everything kind of mixing together. Mm -hmm. The juices are flowing. Mm. Oh, wow. Oh, that's stew pork. The gravy. So comforting and so tender. You ever had macaroni pie before? I have, but I've never had Uncle Clyde's macaroni not and pie. Like this, not like this. Yes. <laughs> oh yes. Oh Zach with the assist. The pepper sauce, yes. Mm -hmm. Oh thank you, Zach. Look at these just ultra tender stewed down pieces of pork. Some of that macaroni pie on the bottom. Yeah. Must. Mm. Oh. It's just so comforting, so warming. Yeah. <laughs> Very good. JD, what's up? You're silent over there. Yeah, <laughs> I've never it. heard you, never heard you this <laughs> silent. Because <laughs> it's CS right now, Bridget. <laughs> oh, and then you've got the starchy um, roots, the cassava. I'll try and you left hand. Okay. You're trying, you left hand. <laughs> It's not, it's not working out there. They're working out? It's not working out. My lord. The left hand is a special Let skill. Let me see. Lord, where one? Hold on. You want to have baby now to eat? <laughs> Go back to your right hand. Yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> oh, the juices are settling at the bottom, so you want to make sure you scoop down with every bite. 
to maximize the flavor. Okay, I'm gonna try that tum tum. Mm. Oh yeah, the tum tum is amazing. <laughs> All the texture of it, smooth. Loving the time. Loving it. <laughs> so here, what we say in Trinidad, when it tastes this good, you get true. You get true. Right, that's it. <laughs> you get true. <laughs> After this, we have to take a little nap. Oh. Oh. A must. That's a must. <laughs> that's a must. After food is. Oh, wow. Oh, that avocado. Zaboka. Zaboka. That is unbelievable. You cannot even believe the creaminess and the sweetness of it. It's literally the texture of butter, but better. You know what we call these? We call them Coco Zaboka. Coco Zaboka. Yeah. So a perfect time to say I get true right after this. I get true. I get true. <laughs> right there. Mm -hmm. I get, I get true. true. <laughs> okay, and digging further down, we've got the macaroni pie. Which I've already had some bites. I just haven't isolated it yet. Fire on the bottom, fire on the top. <laughs> yes, compliments yes. to the chef. Yeah. Oh man. Thanks. Oh, oh, had to get some more. Mm. You can't stop. Oh, that stew. I'm hearing yawning over here. <laughs> the food was too good. It's too good. Are you heavy food? Yeah. Heavy but amazing. Heavy but amazing. Mm. Oh, okay. Okay. So Uncle Clyde is going to make a bush tea. Bush tea. Bush tea for the after after lunch from the mountain right here. The whole thing goes in. Oh, nice. The bay leaves. Oh, okay. That brings out the flavor. Yeah. Love in the house. So we have ginger, we have bay leaf, fever grass, and basilic. So we go to go here. That's a bomb. Great. Yeah. Golden apple now. Golden apple. Because when it's ripe, it's like a golden. golden. Yeah. Okay. Golden apple or yeah. pomme de te? Pomme de te. We say pomme de te. Pomme de te. Pomme de te. Take off the pieces. Yeah. Because the shadow that's right. An after meal snack. They're making something called chow. So you cut up the other one, right? Yeah? yeah. You sure? Yeah. All right. You say I put too much, eh? A little thing more, that's enough. First taste test of the chow. Mmm. Oh. Delicious. Yeah, very good. Salty, sour, sweet, garlicky. Shadow Benny. Does it have pepper? How much? Slight. 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 Man, you sure? What's it for? Oh Lord, here we go, here we go. Mark's slices is our heavier. Slices. <laughs> Your slice is our heavy? Oh yes. I can deal with that man. Thank you very much. Oh, it's our real papa boy. The shadow Benny. The shadow Benny, yes. Mm -hmm. oh. Bright and fresh. The pepper, the pepper. <laughs> but it's, it's really flavor. good. It's flavor, really good, flavor, yeah. burst and tasty, salty. <laughs> but the pepper is a little bit too much for your boy. The pepper level? Mm-hmm. <laughs> 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 <laughs>
Oh, that's good. Really tasty. Oh, uncle. Pass. Okay. Vanessa. Hot. <laughs> Good action. <laughs> Good action. Proper action. <laughs> Proper action. <laughs> 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 That's so <laughs> Um, better belly bust? Better belly bust? Than good food waste. Than good food waste. Mm hmm. <laughs> Jesus. <laughs> Wrong one, I pick. Better belly bust than good food waste. Better belly bust than good food waste. I have plenty belly to bust. <laughs> <laughs> and the bush tea is ready. Yeah. Shut up. I'm ready. Bush team farming is the right thing. Yeah. Cheers. Thank you, Uncle Cheers. Clyde. Yeah. yeah. Thank you, yeah. Cody Nation. Oh, that's just going to aid in the digestion. You ready? You ready? Dance. Dance. Give them. Give them. I put some here on the chest. Okay, Love in the house. Loving the house. Yeah. Love in the house. Yeah. And welcome. <laughs> Enjoy Trinidad. Thank Enjoy you. Thank you for your hospitality. Yeah, of course. Thank you for your hospitality. Yeah. Cheers. Love. Yeah. <laughs> Cheers. And you're welcome anytime again. Thank, Thank you. you. <laughs> oh yeah. But then, if she don't lime, eat, drink, and be yeah, merry. Yeah. And see how we just lime, how we just move. Lime, eat, drink, and be merry. <laughs> yeah. Oh yeah. Thank you. Thank you very much. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you so much. Thank you very much. Love in the house. Love in the house. Yes. This was incredible. Yeah. Good. Welcome anytime. Amazing. Thank you, Uncle Clyde. And so we're back down in Port of Spain after an amazing day in the hills, the mountains of Paramin. Thank you to Uncle Clyde for cooking for us. Thank you to Foodie Nation. They have an amazing YouTube channel for setting this up. Uh, go check out their videos. And thank you to Zach and Vanessa. And most importantly, a huge thank you to Visit Trinidad for sponsoring my trip here to Trinidad, for arranging everything, for setting this up. It's been an amazing trip. We're traveling all around Trinidad and Tobago, so there's gonna be a lot of delicious food and cultural videos uh, so don't miss all the videos from this series thanks again for watching see you on the next video